hi guys welcome back to this video and yet we are still uh, talking about uh, what we call this visa this visa sponsorship for personal for family for a spouse for children for brothers for parents and for a spouse's relatives in one way or the other that's what we're still talking about remember it makes from the next creation if it's your first time come across this channel please consider supporting and subscribing to this channel by the way, don't forget to hit that notification bell because it will only be the only way that you'll be updated whenever we upload a new video. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. In today's video, we are going to look at what we call personal visit visa for other relationship. That other relationship we are talking about, we are talking about your brother, your sister, your mother, your father, your wife's, your spouse's friends or sisters or brothers. They also need other visa requirements. You need to fill up what you call visa requirements for them. There are at documents that you are supposed to fill for them to be accepted to come and visit. And one of the documents, first of all, what I need to let you know is that you are supposed to apply through what you call the person sponsoring, who is already a residency in Qatar here, is supposed to use what you call the metrash, metrash too, where you can apply for those visa under circumstances that you filled up what you call the duty uh the, you filled up what you call all the documents that you are supposed to fit and in today's video let us try to see what are the requirements for you to have in case you're going to sponsor your mother to come and see you in case you're going to sponsor your wife's uh, spouse's friends or, or relatives to come in case you're going to sponsor your sister in case you're going to sponsor your brother to come and see you what are the requirements one of the requirements is that you need to apply what you call you need to to have what you call a visa, visa application form you need to fill that one with all the information duly filled out with no gaps everything that is being asked is that you're supposed to fill it is one of the requirements then also you need a no object or objection letter from your employer a no objection letter you need from the employer as you the person the resident owner or the residence permit owner who is going to sponsor your 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 your, your mother or you're going to sponsor your friends or your brothers to come in this country you definitely need to have what you call no objection letter from your employer then also photocopy of the company id you need to have that photocopy of the company id uh, for that company that you are working for uh, you need to have a photocopy of its id and it's one of the attacked forms that you're also supposed to have then also you're supposed to have a copy of the passport of those people that are going to visit you the people that are going to visit you that we are talking about we are talking about either we are your mother or your father or your your spouse's friends or your spouse's sisters if they are coming to visit you then probably you need to attach a copy of their passports then you need to attach to what you call the applicant's id you need to attach to what you call your id your residence permit id if you are living in Qatar, here you need to attach a copy of your id and that id should be valid should be valid that should be valid and it's also a requirement then also you need to attach a copy of your your wife residence card if she is a resident let's say for example you are you are you are hosting your wife's sisters or your wife's mother and your your wife is also a resident in this country so in this country in Qatar or in, in any of these Gulf countries so what you need if she's a resident and has a copy of the id you also need to attach that id is one of the requirements then also you need to to attach what you call proof of relationship the proof of relationship also has to be attached for example if you are saying the person visiting you is your mother then you have to attach a proof to show that is your mother if the person visiting you is your brother or is your sister you have to attach the proof that is showing you that it is your brother or it is your sister it is required as a fully duly form for you to have the visa approved in one way or the other then still also you need to have what you call a minimum salary we talk about the minimum salary the minimum salary for that is supposed to be the minimum salary for that is supposed to be 10,000 Qatari to sponsor your wife's mother to sponsor your mother to sponsor your wife to sponsor your children your your brother or to sponsor your sister in one way or the other hope i've tried to share up something for you uh thank you so much for coming back to this channel i'll always update you and i'll always get you and always give you the information in time thank you so much for subscribing to this channel and thank you so much watch my videos is makes from the next creation see you again in another video